I'll show you how to use the bioactive cyanuric reducer in your pool to lower your cyanuric acid level without draining your pool down. And bioactive is sold in 8 ounce pouches and also a 16 ounce commercial size. An 8 ounce pouch is good for up to 25,000 gallons of water and a 16 ounce pouch is good for 50,000 gallons of water. If your cyanuric acid level is over 200, you may need more than one 8 ounce pouch to lower it down. Okay, so there are a few parameters for this to work correctly. The chlorine level needs to be 5 parts per million or less. 2 to 3 parts per million is ideal. Your water temperature needs to be 65 degrees Fahrenheit or higher, 18.3 degrees Celsius. Get an accurate cyanuric acid level before you start the test. You can use a test kit. This is the K2006. It comes with the cyanuric acid test. You can also take a water sample into your local pool store. They'll test the cyanuric acid level for you. You want to make sure you don't shock your pool before or after doing this process. High levels of chlorine will burn off the product. If you cover your pool door in a week, you want to leave the cover open during this treatment. It's also a good idea to know your pool size. This pool here is about 22,000 gallons of water. Go ahead and use a dilution test here. I'm going to use half tap water, half pool water, and I'll go ahead and put it in here and mix it with the reagent to test the cyanuric acid level. Let me do the tap water first. So I got one teaspoon of tap water, one teaspoon of the pool water. Pour it into here, to the seven milliliter mark. And I'm gonna add the reagent to the 14 milliliter mark. I'm gonna go ahead and shake it up. I you want to shake it for about 30 seconds. So since this is half tap water and half pool water, we're going to multiply everything by two. I'm going to fill it up until the black dot disappears. That'll be our conditioner reading. Okay, so showing right at the 100 mark. So our cyanuric acid level in this pool is about 200 parts per million. Now we want to check to make sure the chlorine level is in range here. So according to the Taylor test kit, the chlorine level in this pool is about two and a half parts per million. It's showing roughly that here with the OTO tester. This pool is in good range for the cyanuric acid reducer, testing 2.5 parts per million of chlorine. Cyanuric acid level is testing around 200 parts per million. And the water temperature is 69 degrees. The pH in here was about 7.8. You get a little more accurate reading when the pH is a little bit lower, but I would say it was in range to get a good accurate cyanuric acid reading in the initial test. Since this pool is about 200 parts per million, I'm going to go ahead and use the 16 ounce bioactive bag in this particular pool. Okay, we're going to pour the bioactive directly into the skimmer with the pool running for at least four hours. You want to pour the whole pack in. Okay, so you want to run it four hours after adding the bioactive, and you also want to make sure the pool runs for at least four hours per day. And back over here 48 hours later, I'm going to go ahead and do another dilution test. Okay, let me pour the water in here and I'll go ahead and run the test. Okay, let's see what kind of level we have here. Okay, so I did a test the second day back. It looks like it's coming in at 70, which is 140. Test strips just give you a ballpark reading. You can see that it's definitely lighter here. 48 hours after adding the bioactive cyanuric reducer. Here it is before I added the cyanuric reducer. You can see that it's much darker in color and this one here is much lighter. So according to my testing, after 48 hours, the bioactive cyanuric acid reducer has dropped the level down in this pool by at least 60 parts per million. Let's look at the bioactive cyanuric acid reducer. It's a great way to lower your cyanuric acid level in your pool without having to drain your pool water down.